watching CBS 2 News This Morning in High Definition. Good morning and welcome in on this Thursday. Time now 544. Experts say right now is probably the worst possible time to lose your job. How bad is the economy in our area? Check out the lines wrapped around the block in the Garment District yesterday as people waited to get into a job fair. It's that bad. It really is. So what can you do to try to make sure you don't end up standing in one of these lines? CBS 2's Kirsten Cole has some timely advice. Marissa Martinez is about to become a statistic. My company has given me until January to find a new job. Um, I'm one of the fortunate few that has a little bit of notice. Nothing could be worse today than to be unemployed. Headhunter and author Stephen Viscusi says the main goal now is to stay employed since it can take three years or more to find a new position. Viscusi takes his decades of experience getting people jobs and outlines 50 secrets and tricks in his new book, Bulletproof Your Job, that he guarantees will keep you employed even in these tough times. The most important of them, first and foremost, get friendly with the boss. In a recessionary economy, there's nothing wrong with a little brown nosing when it comes to saving your job. Because employers find it harder to fire someone they personally know and like. So talk about the kids, talk about your spouse, and don't be afraid to suck up a little. Secondly, it's really important to get along with your coworkers. Don't be a high maintenance employee complaining about your workload, the size of your cubicle, or anything else. Telecommuting, out of sight, out of mind. It's not a time to take long vacations, plan that hiatus, or have a lot of children problems. Other ways to bulletproof your post? Look your best. Simply whitening your teeth or dressing more professionally. Now's the time to speak up and volunteer for projects and introduce yourself to managers you may not know. Some advice from the front lines? Do you realize if you come to work five minutes earlier than the boss or stay five minutes later than the boss, all the boss knows is that you're always there. You were there before them, you were there after them. Is it a trick? Maybe, but it will guarantee to you to bulletproof your job. And if the boss does come to you with that buyout package, have a counter offer ready. Say you'll cut back to three or four days or take a salary decrease. Remember to keep your job while you're looking for the next one. On the West Side, I'm Kirsten Cole, CBS 2 News. And for a lot more secrets and tips for keeping your job, you can log on to WCBSTV.com. Click on the consumer section.